Good morning, everyone. So we're just getting up and getting ready for the day, and the kids lately have been making their own breakfast because this guy wants to be a chef someday. But he started making pancakes this morning with Bailey, and they didn't realize that we were out of eggs. Luckily though, my sister Rachel and I made a video a little while ago about vegan egg substitutes and we haven't posted that video yet but i still have a list of egg substitutes here so we'll just go through these until we find something that we have at our house uh let's see do we have bananas no okay nope bananas are out do we have silken tofu no no chickpea flour maybe i don't think so i don't think so okay applesauce yes applesauce Oh my goodness, they're working. I cannot believe that worked so well. I can tell you that it did not work as just scrambled eggs. The applesauce. But it does work, apparently, in pancakes. But the true test will be how it tastes. How'd they turn out? Good. How's your food? Is it yummy? Say thank you, Bailey. Good sign language. I got my eye plate. He garnished it with applesauce, cause he's a chef. We are so excited because this segment of the video is sponsored and approved by Nintendo. Ooh, approved. Yeah, they approved it. Thanks guys. Nintendo just sent us a huge box in the mail. Three, two, one. Whoa. Wishing the Ballinger family happy holidays from your friends at Nintendo. A Nintendo Switch. <laughs> this is awesome. Thank you so much, Nintendo. Wow, look at that. It's a Christmas tree ornament for our tree. Whoa. Extra Joy-Con controllers. <gasps> yes. Nintendo Labo set at a convention, and it's so much fun. I can't wait to actually create one of these for myself. car and your key goes into the steering wheel like so and then you can drive around. I feel like we should give it a whirl. <laughs> I'm gonna take the Nintendo Switch console and put it into the Switch dock and that way I can hook it up to a TV or in this case our projector. Oh my <laughs> Right now they're using the projector but with Nintendo Switch they can play together anytime anywhere. We got to work on it as a family, which was really, really fun. You learned about gears, there are these gears in these ones, pulley systems, levers, all this cool stuff. It's really hands-on and interactive. It's really, really fun to do. And you're playing it with things that you actually built with your own hands. And there's even a discovery section where you can find out how things work and invent new ways to play. Oh, yeah. <laughs> mom, I'm just so impressed that Nintendo is creating a hands-on activity to incorporate with their games. And I just, I, I love the concept. It's perfect for my kids. Tell us in the comments below what you would create if you got a Nintendo Labo kit for the holidays. You guys can check out their official website and the trailer for the Nintendo Labo. I put links in the description below. I also want to say thank you one last time to Nintendo for sponsoring and approving this segment of the video. So the kids wanted to make some gifts for people and we got some canvas and we got some paint and we're gonna do a little painting. Yeah, I have a plan already. I'm You've got a plan? Making a horse soon. Wait, do I get to paint? Yes! I get to paint too? You don't 
think I'd use this one. Why not? Because it's mine. Oh, okay. I'll let you use I that one. I got two. You got two? All right. So everyone has a plan? Yep. Let's get some paint going. What are you gonna paint, Dada? I'm not sure yet. Mine's gonna be a forest, and I don't exactly know how it's gonna work out. So far, it's working much better than I thought it would be. I don't really know what mine is, so... I'm just gonna make my own thing, but I don't know why. Are you making it for somebody? Yeah, it's gonna be baby stuff friends. But I have to do the whole family. I'm going to make Santa Claus, but so far I'm making a friend. Bailey finished hers. Jacob finished his. Where's yours? So somewhere drying? And Parker's is over here in the sunshine because his paint's a little thick. So it might need a little more heat to dry. And Parker did another one. So I have challenges that we have to do. And so my first challenge was a forest. Dad did accepted it. it. Now he's doing a fishbowl. And you did a forest, and now you're doing a fishbowl too? Mm -hmm. Done! I did this forest. Should I do a fishbowl also? Yes! I still have some more work to do on mine. I don't think I have time to make a fishbowl. So you did a second one here. What is this? This one is a Christmas tree. I like it. I see the lights on there. So Jacob has switched styles here, and has gone from like scenes to abstract art. And I love it. Here's the other one Jacob did. I think these are awesome. These are so cool looking. And here's your new one. That's awesome. It takes like 30 seconds. 30 se you like the 30 second painting? Yeah. So this is a fishbowl. Oh, this is a forest. This is a roller coaster. This is uh, mountains. I only made two. This was my first one. It's a forest by the pond and I did one of those things where like the pond was spilling out of the frame. This is a picture of a fishbowl on a table with a cat. Duncan was taking a nap while we were doing our painting. Do you want to paint? Yeah. You do? You want to paint? Yeah. Looks like Bailey got you all set up with a smock. Here's a brush. So good! How did you make that? I've never known a baby who could do this. Except you. <laughs> don't eat it. I don't want you to eat that. Yeah, it's paint. Can you say paint? Parker's decided to join you. What do you think of that? You all done? This is a beautiful painting. Look at that masterpiece. Hey, that's all we got for you today. I wanna to give a shout out to Emily Gabriel. Thanks for watching our videos. Make sure to leave a comment in the comment section down below. And if you do, we might pick your name to give you a shout out in a future video. So don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you like what we do. And we'll see you next time.